what's up guys hope you are doing well there and welcome to my youtube channel seek show today's video is specially for the gis analyst cartographers geographers and especially for the drone lovers i will show you top 10 drones that you can use that you can practice for your gis applications let's get started but before that please hit the red subscribe button down there and click the bell icon to get the latest updates I will start with number 10. This is RI Copter with VUX SYS. You can see the website here. This drone can be used for precision agriculture, topography in an open cast mining, terrain and canyon mapping, especially surveying of urban environments. This drone can produce LiDAR data which is very expensive in the market. It is possible to capture RGB images with outstanding accuracy that can reach up to 10 mm. Ultimately, I can tell this is a completely miniaturized airborne la laser scanning system. And if you want more details, please check the description for the link. You can collect some additional details, information, specifications using this website. Then I am going for number 9. Bremer PPX, you can see the drone here. This is somewhat old but works very smooth, best match for serving and remote sensing applications. This is capable of measuring precise results down to 1 meter with a ground sampling distance that start at 0.9 cm. Flight time is about 3.1 hour. This has multiple sensors. This can be used to generate 3D models, 3D landscape models, digital elevation models and auto mosaics. Especially all these processes can be uh, done automatically. You can see the specifications using this website. Right, then I am going for my number 8 Tupper drone. You can see, uh, we can collect the, uh, the other information using this website. But I will give you overall idea uh, about this uh, topo drone. This is another mapping drone. It comes with uh, a direct, uh, direct georeferencing solution. That means a mapping without ground control, which considered a huge advantage. It has a large uh, mapping spectrum, which means uh, using same camera and changing uh, three spectra filters. You can capture several useful types of data like the RGB color image, NIR image and uh, this comes with a software for flight planning and it can automatically generate 3D landscape models, digital elevation models and auto mosaics you can see here. Uh, this is my number 8 and then I am going for EasyMap, EasyMap UAV you can see their uh, official website. There are a number of details uh, in this website. Uh, this is another amazing mapping drone. Uh, this was initially developed in uh, 2012 according to my research and they have updated their software uh, and the device in 2017. This drone uh, is the most user-friendly photo mapping tool in the market. Uh, made up of uh, durable composite materials with 100% uh, automatic operations. You can expect high speed and excellent uh, even in the excellent uh, wind condition. This has a super safe belly landing, super safe belly landings with multiple sensor support RGB and NIR. This can produce several important data such as 3D city models, point clouds, 3D landscape models, digital elevation models, digital terrain models, all the mosaics and especially NDVI maps you can see. This is easy map. You can check for the link in the description section. Then I am going for number six in the list, Trimble UX5 HP. This is equipped with global navigation satellite system GNSS. Uh, this drone comes with two sensors RGB for cartography and mapping, infrared sensors for environmental lists. This can work under any climate conditions, uh, uh, even in the windy conditions, as powerful as 55 km per hour. Software package is enhanced and uh, with a lot of uh, features. 
you can uh, you can use this drone for making 3d colored colored images and generating digital elevation models trimble ux5 hp unmanned uh, aircraft system then i will go for similar draw uh, ux5 this is somewhat different from the previous one and this is perfect for mapping and serving specialist this is also equipped with high-end camera sensor manufactured by sony so you can expect better quality images you can this can produce uh, amazing pictures up to two millimeter two meter resolution i i guess so this can capture very sharp images with full of colors customized software programs makes flying plans much easier for beginners that means you can uh, start uh, flying you can uh, use this drone flying without any uh, effort right then i will go for my number four uh, you can see the details uh, in the drone this is 3d solo drone you can see the price and some other details you can buy this drone from uh, amazon right uh, this is very special drone why this is uh, this supports even gopro you can you know the action camera gopro this drone allows to uh, switch or change cameras depending on your project that means you may based on your based on the nature of your project you can change the cameras in this drone that that is a very special thing and uh, you can expect a flight range uh, flying range around uh, 0.8 kilometer with a 25 minutes flight time and speed of uh, 55 miles per hour and you can expect a uh, number of uh, special features from this drone this uh, produces uh, high quality customizable images and a great choice for researchers individuals choreographers if you are a choreographer geographer and map maker you can buy this drone from the amazon right okay then i am going for my next one this is very handy drone uh, called uh, nano blade nano you can see the size of this image uh, size of this drone this is uh, suitable for beginners cheap and efficient drone that means if you want to try first try with the drone you better go for this uh, blade nano because this is very cheap and efficient drone for the beginners simple controls you can expect from this uh, a draw and a number of features are available flight time is around 10 minutes that is uh, too less for one minute uh, 20 for 25 minute full charge it will take 25 minutes to full charge and the flight time is around 10 minutes this has sensor support for landing blade nano you can see the additional details from this website you can if you want you can uh, buy this one right then i am going for my number two sense flying you can see the their official website and uh, this drone is specially designed for gis purpose not for the beginners if you want uh, to try a drone you better you go for this uh, blade nano if you are a gis user specially designed uh, drone is uh, sense flight right it's not for beginners this can scan up to 12 miles and produces images with a resolution of 1.5 centimeters per pixel especially this weighs around 700 grams around 680 grams this drone can stay up to one hour nearly one hour 50 uh, 50 minutes in the air and it comes with a radio link zones of uh, three kilometer you can see uh, additional details as you can see uh, this indices uh, mining queries uh, aggregates engineering and construction mapping gis environmental all of these uh, industries uh, you can use this uh, sense flight drone then i am uh, if you want to go for uh, read for other details i have provided the link in the description section check the link and my final one number one dji phantom tree for now i have added this one into number one uh, the company has provided later versions of this uh, dji phantom pro versions you can check for updated device in this from the same company one of the best and recommended drone for nowadays two kilometer range with 
25 minute flight time. 4K quality with uh, stabilization provides a big support for the GI specialist. This is accompanied with the GPS to help you in cartography and tracking especially. You can uh, see the 4K camera advanced in optics, shoots in a row and no longer has fish eye. Flying experience as easy as playing a video game like very easy to fly. Finally, you can collect a number of data including altitude, speed, position. I can recommend this drone especially for GIS and remote sensing users. Okay, if you want to get more details, please check the description for the links uh, in the, about the drones. And that's all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this one. Hope you saw something new. Hope you learned something new. If you are interested, please hit a like for this video. And if you want to see more educational stuff, please uh, click the red subscribe button down there and click the bell icon to get the latest notifications, latest updates. I will be back with another video for you soon. Till then, goodbye.